Brooke, absolutely. Clemson head coach Dabo Sweeney is from Pelham. He has crimson in his blood. He went to Alabama. He won a national championship in 1992. He even coached the Crimson Tide. But when it comes to his Alabama fans, friends back home, he has one message for them. It's time to shed the red. You know, he's got people torn. He's got some people with him, some people against him. And he, that's what he says now. You know, anybody he's talking to this his friends say, hey, who you with? Norman Saya considers Dabo Sweeney a brother. The two went to high school together at Pelham, walked on the football team in Alabama, and Dabo was Norman's best man in his wedding. I mean, I always knew he was special. I mean, he's, all, he's always been kind of a teacher and, and a helper of people his whole life. Dabo's life was dedicated to Alabama football until he was hired as a wide receivers coach at Clemson in 2003 and eventually promoted to head coach in 2008. That leaves friends like Charlie Hall torn. It's tough because, I mean, I'm a season ticket holder at Alabama, but just to be honest, I mean, the Sweeney's are such good people and everybody around them are such good people. It, it's hard to sit there and, and root against somebody like that. I told somebody the other day, I said, Saban's got four, you know, Dabo needs one. Everybody's shedding the red. Charlie might be wearing all orange right now, but he also brought Bama gear to Arizona. He tells me his dream situation for Dabo. I mean, I, th I think that's what, that's what I kind of look as a win-win. Let's say Dabo wins this game. Well, he's got a national championship, so I figure either way we win, because he wins here and then, you know, when Saban retires, he's definitely, you know, he's already got the credibility, but he's definitely somebody that, you know, now would be on the top of everybody's list.